I was going to talk over the top five problems I see on these heart welders. If your transformer's gone, it's uh, you may as well just replace the whole lot. And then you've got your main incoming switch. Could be faulty, so test that. I will do tests in a minute. I'll just talk it through at the minute. So test the continuity across the switch. Test the continuity of your earth electrode and your torch electrode. There's also this device which is a thermal cutout. If the transformer overheats this will cut out to protect the windings. That is one of the major failures I'll come across because people use them too harshly and they overheat. And that is about it with them really. These mechanisms can go but there ain't a lot of fixing them. I will just clean this one up and grease it though. So that's it. Switches, earth and torch electrodes and wires, thermal cutout and the, the main switch and the incoming cables. I'll do them tests in a minute. The meter set to continuity so it beeps and I've got it set across the switch so when you operate the switch it will go on and off. Do both sides of the switch. This is a double pole switch, it's switching the live on the neutrals. But while you're here you can test between the live one end and then between the plug at the other end of the plug so I've got one end on there and the other one going to live on the plug so that's telling me the wires are alright and the switch is alright obviously do the neutral as well and do the neutral side of the switch as well. So that's that. Next I'm going to test this thermal cutter, if we can get to the metal. So obviously that thermal cutter has got a continuity across it so it's good. Then check from this side of the electrode and test at the other end I'll just set it up now I'm just testing from one end which is there to the earth clamp so it's got good continuity all the way from here all the way to the end of the earth clamp so do the same with the torch so there you go testing from one end of the torch to the other. You can now disconnect the wires and check the primary and secondary ones of the transformer if you want but it don't matter. If you got this far and if you're testing good that's probably your transformer that's gone so you might as well scrap it. Well that's it. You can obviously you can check the connections as well. Make sure everything's tight. So I'm just testing for resistance across the earth and the torch and I'm getting a reading 0.4 ohms so that's telling me that the secondary winding is in good condition if you want to test the primary just test it here these two black wires here 